Well, Ian Rappaport, Rap Sheet, he was on the Pat McAfee show today, and, and he's a guest on there from time to time, but he was on there to talk some Lamar Jackson. What is going on with Lamar Jackson? What's happening? Uh, Pat McAfee and his boys, they were like, man, this thing is getting ugly between the Ravens and Lamar Jackson. What is going on? And Ian Rappaport, he said, hold up now, buddies. It's not getting ugly. Don't You ain't got to worry about that. He said that, I don't think... Lamar Jackson's absence is contract related. Uh, he said that he believes the reason that Lamar Jackson has been out, has continued to remain out, is because of the injury, the PCL injury. He said it's normally an injury that takes three weeks to get over, but hey, everybody's different. Everybody's body is different. Sometimes it can take longer. He said in Lamar Jackson's case, it is taking longer. Uh, he also talked about how he does not expect Lamar Jackson to play this week. And I think we all came to that same conclusion yesterday uh, when it was th said that Lamar Jackson did not practice. And then uh, they followed that up today with him not practicing again. So he's been out the past two practices. So I don't think anybody should have expected him to play this week. And I mean, even on top of that, um, I don't even really think the starters are going to play this week. We'll see. But like this week, the seating could change. But not based off of the Ravens game alone. Like, they would need to either win or lose. And then they need all these other scenarios to happen for them to move to, like, five or six seed. And I think there's even one scenario where they can move to the three seed. So, but bottom line, this game doesn't really mean much. It doesn't really mean much. Um, so with that being said, and especially with them, like, really getting ready to just, I guess, sort of officially cancel uh, the Bills and Bengals game then th this game won't have any impact on really much of anything for the Ravens uh, or, the, or the Bengals. Um, so let's see what happens as far as starters or backups or whatever. Um, but although Ian Rappaport did say that Lamar Jackson is not expected to play in this game, uh, he said that the Ravens are expecting Lamar Jackson back for the playoffs. And again, that, that's what a lot of people have thought, uh, even though a lot of people think that he may not even play in the playoffs. Um, there's still the back and forth between people, the speculation on whether he's holding out or if he's truly just not ready yet. Um, so we, we won't know till we know. We won't know till we know. But Rappaport did say, he said, the only way that Lamar Jackson is not playing in the playoffs would be if he had a setback. If he had a setback, then that would be the way that he wouldn't be able to go. Because that would mean that something happened with his PCL injury. Uh, everything wasn't going as planned, and he couldn't play. So, I mean, we'll see. We'll 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 see what happens with that. It's just, yeah, we're just waiting it out, man. We're just really waiting it out. I think so many Ravens fans are past this last this week eighteen, this last regular season game. I think so many Ravens fans not even not even that they're not thinking about it, but they they are way past that and they just think in playoffs what's going to happen what's going to go down is Lamar Jackson going to be the quarterback is it going to be Tyler Huntley is it going to be Anthony Brown and I mean even this week it could end up being Anthony Brown because Tyler Huntley in practice today he was limited yet again and just because you're limited that doesn't mean that you can't go but you being limited you're not being a full participant that's not really a good thing um so could it be Anthony Brown that gets to start against the Bengals? Uh, whether the Ravens play starters or not, it could happen. So I guess we got to wait and see. Uh, Marcus Peters was also limited. But again, I, I wouldn't expect his first game back to be in a meaningless game against the Bengals in week 18. Playoffs, okay, yeah, but this game, nah. Um, they also said that Calais Campbell, Ronnie Stanley, they returned as well. So that was good. Deshaun Jackson, however, he did not return. Um, something else that Pat McAfee brought up was the, uh, the reports from, you know, the one from Mike Preston that, that talked about Lamar Jackson being a slacker and him, uh, and, and it being known to the coaches, uh, just that Lamar Jackson, his work ethic is not there. And you know what I find interesting, very interesting. This is not the first time that we heard about off-field stuff with Lamar Jackson, this is not like even, again, remember the guy who, who did the report, uh, who was interviewing Lamar Jackson, oh, I heard you don't like to work out. So this is not the first time this year that Lamar Jackson's work ethic has been questioned. And there was another report too. And, but I just, I just find it so strange and coincidental that it's all coming out in this year. Because let me know if I'm wrong. Please let me know if I'm wrong. 
I don't recall us ever hearing anything about that in his first year, in his second year, in his third year, or even in his fourth year. I don't recall any of that. But again, let me know if I'm wrong because y'all know my memory be messed up. Y'all know I forget a lot of stuff. And hey, I ain't perfect. I ain't perfect. So yeah, I, I, I forget. So if there's something that I didn't catch or I just can't recall right now, please let me know. But we do also know something that I won't ever forget is that the NFL is a dirty game. It's a very, very dirty, 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 dirty game. Um, but again, yeah, we'll see how everything ends up playing itself out. But anyway, I love y'all team. Keep it clean. I appreciate y'all team. Keep it clean. And again, it's just it's a wait and see approach with Lamar Jackson, and the Baltimore Ravens. Will he be back come playoff time or will he still continue to remain out? Only time will tell. Love y'all.